Amid the harshest cold wave yet, Taiwan is also in the grip of what could be the second longest cold spell this century. The cold wave that arrived yesterday is only expected to let up slightly on Wednesday, which will have been five days of continuous cold, the longest cold spell in 14 years. And looking to the coming week, while Friday will warm up significantly, another cold wave will arrive on Saturday evening. Each pedestrian on the street is bundled up in warm clothing as Taiwan's cold spell continues. With five consecutive days of cold weather forecast, it will be the second longest cold spell this century and only outdone by a period in 2004 when temperatures were beneath 10 degrees Celsius for six days. Atmospheric blocking is to blame for the lengthy cold wave. Over the Pacific Ocean's north, between America and Asia, is a high-pressure atmospheric block. Because its position is stationary, it is creating the cold wave that is affecting us here. It has no way of migrating eastward, so there will be wave after wave of cold weather moving southwards and affecting Taiwan. It has begun to snow in Taiwan's alpine areas. Abundant water vapour in the air has caused all the peaks of Taiping Shan to be cloaked in a vast expanse of white. Taoyuan's La La Mountain also saw fresh snow late last night, turning ancient forests into a silver wonderland. The Central Weather Bureau says tomorrow and Tuesday will tend to see low temperatures in the early morning. They may dip as low as 7 degrees in Taiwan's northern regions, 9 degrees in its central regions and only around 10 degrees in southern areas. On Wednesday the cold wave is expected to weaken and temperatures will gradually be slightly higher. It will only really begin to warm up on Friday, but there could be the arrival of yet another cold wave on Saturday night.